it is about 35 minutes past our traditional Anil r- r- reveal each time. And the entire shop's quiet. We've turned off the music. Everyone's getting things done. I can see like 10 people running around in circles, throwing pumpkins to the left, to the right. It's just getting crazy in here. We've specifically placed this camera in this direction to not reveal to you guys all the craziness that's getting put together right now for our VIP pumpkin show, which is in about like an hour and 55 minutes. There's still plenty of setup to do. We got a lot going on over here. We're starting with the Van Goghs are going to be the first reveal on the show. We've got seven styles of pumpkins that we're going to cycle through throughout the show. It's going to be really hardcore. Super excited. We got some, oh my God, there's just so much about to happen. It's going to be a sweet four-hour show. There's still time if you guys are just showing up now or you're still just getting your schedule figured out to purchase a ticket and join us at 4 o'clock for a four-hour exclusive VIP special event. It's going to be hardcore. Uh, two of these pieces, three of them actually, are going to be for sale, all three. I think this was put online, but I'm not sure if it's sold or not, so it is going to be available on the show here tonight. <clears throat> um, and then, of course, we got the giveaway. So I'm going to show you guys that briefly, and then we're going to get back to work and get back to setting everything up. Uh, we started off the show with the Shugs and the bar color, so we wanted to show you this. I'm going to turn the monitor so I can make sure that I am getting you guys that bling blingification in the camera. Take a look at that. Look at the way that thing totally uh, metallicized on the stem. You got that deep transparent pink. No splotchiness in the pink at all. It's completely solid and deep and tasty. Look at the bottom there. And then the super tiny grain shugs on there is pretty out of control. It's got some nice texture to it. It's uh, less melted in on the ribs. And then in between, you see it start to stretch from blowing up the pumpkin and you see it start to melt in a little bit and get smooth. This is a gorgeous pumpkin. This is gonna be on the uh, sugar table, which I believe might be the third of seven tables that are gonna be revealed. But this thing's hardcore. Look at that stem connection laid down perfect, super tight ribs on there. I love this motion right here on the stem when it comes back around real smooth and elegant. That one turned out incredible. Super nice piece. <clears throat> will be for sale. Then we moved on to Chris getting warmed up is what he was doing and made this ridiculous out of control vase that's going to be for sale on the show tonight. Hear some crackling noises in the background. You never know what that could be. But look at the way the stems just curl down to either side. You got two leaves on there. A stem coming straight from the leaf. Look at the color. You couldn't see that bright orange when we were making it because it was still so hot. You got green in the core of all the curls on the bottom and the top. Iridescent gold spots. They almost look like little spots of mirror and a super elegant shape. I love the way he flared the lip up top. And I spoke about on the show the difficulty of keeping it symmetrical. Look at how symmetrical he kept it for having so much weight down here and the extra curls and the super heavy duty heats he was doing. It's hardcore and you can see the size of it in my hands. This was a pretty large piece. There was nothing tiny about this guy. He's almost like a giant football. Feels pretty cozy in my hand like this, but hopefully nobody ever holds it like this. Once it hits the table, you got flowers in it and it's good to go. Um, but just pretty out of control, guys. This one's gonna be for sale. Don't have any prices for you yet. We're going to have a nice, uh, if time allows, miscellaneous section of all our harvest one-of-a-kind pieces at the end of our VIP show, and that's where this is going to make an appearance. Super tight. GA stamps on the bottom. I didn't show that off, but it's down there. Then we went on to the giant jumbo gnome, the biggest one and most successful one so far. You heard me talking to Chris about making one of these at the Renaissance Festival one time, and the hat didn't work. So Chris queued up a gorgeous hat and it went on pretty much as smooth as it possibly could have. A little bit thicker on the bottom, right down upon the schnoz, the bright uh, red honker. And then you got the super poppin' multi-swirled enamel white beard, black boots, a kind of light orange and white body to the back. There's the GA stamp. 
I don't need to show you his uh, bottom too much in detail. It's a little revealing. But uh, just look at the curvature of the stem and the nature of it. I mean, it looks straight like a gnome hat. It went on perfect, and I think we may have to do hats like that going forward as we start to make some larger gnomes. He turned out incredible. He's going to be for sale on the show as well. That's a big boy right there. you got to cradle him a little bit, kind of like I was the vase. So that's super nice. And then the giveaway is, I think, the third or the fourth pumpkin slug of the season. Joey made this one. Take a look at him with the white eyes looking right at you. What do you say about me? He'll give you the look. But look at the elegant swoosh. Less of a tail on this one. He's not high tailing it so much, but it's elegant. Curls right back towards it. And you got the double curl back and forth ponytail special on the top of this slimy little fella. GA stamp right on the bottom. Iridescent spots on there. Orange pumpkin action. The gold on the stem really went to Bling Town. It's pretty darn hardcore. So that turned out amazing right there as well. I apologize, you guys. I don't have the chat up because we're in such prep for the VIP show tonight. Everyone Loves Everything is confirmed from uh, tech support over here. We got Sam in the house tonight. We got Marissa. We got uh, Moe's volunteering over here. You guys may or may not have met her. You might see her on the show tonight. We're going to see. Um, Michelle's going to town. We got a great customer and friend of ours, Kurt's here. Brought us some pizzas while we're setting up and getting everything organized. Huge and super nice. Joey's over there. Robin just walked up in the house, getting to town in the shipping area. Marissa's in the front office going to town. Donna's going to be here. We pretty much got the entire crew here tonight. Uh, Chris isn't here yet. He's on his way. And we're about an hour and uh, 40, an hour and 50 minutes till showtime. So I'm going to leave it at that, folks. We're going to get back to work. We appreciate you all, and whether you're watching the show or not, we appreciate you guys and your support of our arts all the time. Uh, but there still is time for a $20 ticket. I'll give you a hint right now. Free shipping on every product that's going to be for sale tonight. I don't know if Michelle wanted me to say that or not, so I kind of lowered my voice. She's right over there. But uh, you could almost think of that as like a trade-off right there just to get on the show. $20 ticket. It's going to be a beautiful thing. Never before seen pumpkins, all one and done, one of a kinders, and we're getting riled up about it. We're excited. So I appreciate you guys. We'll look forward to talking to you soon. Thanks to our VIP sponsors that have already been subscribed to us and are supporting what we do, and we'll catch you all on the show tonight at 4 o'clock sharp, and we're looking forward to it.